The most precious resource America has are the men and women who voluntarily serve their country in the U.S. military. I've served in law enforcement for 33 years and have even been shot in the line of duty. I know the stress and split-second decisions law enforcement officers make, but these decisions pale in comparison to the daily situations our soldiers must make in a war zone in the Middle East. Some of these soldiers have made choices in a combat zone to protect themselves or their troops, which resulted in the U.S. government convicting them of murder and implementing lengthy prison sentences in Leavenworth Prison. We have come to know these men and believe each of them are a worthy cause to fight for. Our son, Lieutenant Michael Behenna, has been released on parole from Leavenworth, but other soldiers remain in prison for war zone decisions they have made. The U.S. military has repeatedly released from custody foreign fighters who killed our troops. These terrorists, captured by our troops, are released on a pledge that they will not return to the fight, but we know that our troops have fought the same men on multiple occasions. Yet our soldiers stay incarcerated long after these wars have been finished. Please help to bring attention to these forgotten U.S. soldiers of Middle Eastern wars and help these men return to their families where they belong.